Austin Sendrick weaving sideways to make sure there's plenty of fuel. Dalton Sargent saw how he rubbed him last time. Here they go. Two by two. Green flag is out. We're ready for a two lap. Cindric lost the race this year at the Arca Racing Series. One of the one great right hand finger stayed out on fuel and stretched it. That might have been the hand of Cindric here in the decision to stay out as long as they have. Shane Lee having all kinds of problems with his race car. He has dropped back through the field, back to about eighth right now. Dalton Sargent trying to put some pressure on the young driver, Austin Cindric, but this time they'll come by for the white flag at Kentucky. One and a half miles to go for the first win for Austin Cindric. And tip back to third, also pitted with Sargent up with 30 laps remaining. Race. He's on a charge in that black and white, black and yellow Chevrolet. For the final time, Ray, Cedric appears to have enough fuel to turn three. All he's got to do is get through the center of three and then through four. He should have enough fuel to get all the way through the trioval here in Kentucky. And Austin Cedric from Mooresville, North Carolina, will get his first career win in ARCA. He wins at the Kentucky Speedway. Cedric becomes our eighth first time winner this season. How dominant his car has been at times. At Pocono, he had a car that was a second and a half faster than the leader, Enfinger, who was on a fuel mileage saving run. That was reversed here today. Cindric had a fast car from start to finish. Congratulations to Brian, his crew chief. He was able to make that gutsy call of saying, we'll pit on 26 and we're staying out. Our car's good enough. And guess what? It played out that way. All of the guys behind him had pitted on lap 70, got fresh tires, and they were not able to go up and challenge this young man. So a first-time victory. We'll hear from him when we come back to Kentucky. You're watching the ARCA Racing Series right here on FS2.